Welcome back. In our last video we learned about reverse candlestick psychology. If you haven't yet watched our previous video about the reverse candlestick psychology, we strongly recommend watching it first before watching this video. Let's get started. In this video we're going to talk about how reversal patterns work. Reversal candlestick psychology is one of the reasons why reversal patterns are such effective predictors of price reversals. Here is an example why. Here, we see the bullish engulfing pattern has formed and the market is moving up. All the previous sellers from the bear candlestick are now at a paper loss and will be looking to exit their positions at break even or so they hope with buy trades forming an area of support. If prices move back down into the range of the bearish candlestick body, you can bet that the previous sellers will quickly buy or close their trades, pushing the market price back up. Similarly, after a bearish engulfing pattern has formed and prices continue to move down, the previous buyers from the bull candlestick are suffering a paper loss and will be looking to exit their trades at break-even with sell trades, forming an area of resistance. If prices move back up into the range of the bull candlestick body, the previous buyers will immediately exit their positions with sell trades, pushing the market price down again. This is an extremely powerful concept and you will do well to trade according to it. Take a moment now to digest this information. Watch this section again if you have to. If you don't understand what's going on here, the next section will probably confuse you. Before we move on, it's important that you understand the implications of profit-taking in the market. When traders don't take into account profit-taking behavior, they'll often be tricked into placing low winning probability trades. Here's what I mean. In the candle formation, we might be fooled into thinking that this is the start of a price reversal after all, we can see the strong momentum of the bear candle, not to mention a bearish engulfing pattern. But in this case, a large bear candle doesn't necessarily mean that the sellers are getting stronger. Due to the strong upward trend of the first three bull candles, we must now take into consideration the possibility of buyers who are now taking their profits, for example buyers who are in the profit trades and have exited their positions. If you noticed, the close price of the last bear candle did not go lower than the open price of the first bull candle, which is, you guessed it, an anchor candle. This means it's entirely possible for most of the selling activity, at this point, to be coming from the buyers who are exiting their positions. We'll need to see more commitment from the sellers, who aren't the previous buyers, before we can say that prices are likely to reverse. A stronger signal for a price reversal would be this. See how the close price for the last bear candle is lower than the open price of the anchor candle. This tells us that it's likely that there are more sellers in the market than just the previous buyers. How will I know for sure when profit taking is happening? Unfortunately, you can't know for sure. You'll just have to consider other factors that can increase your chances of making a well-informed decisions. For example, traders are more likely to take their profits at prominent support resistance levels. We will learn more about this in a later video. Thank you for watching. If you found this information useful, please share my video with your friends. If you have any questions or suggestions, please feel free to leave me a comment below. And if you enjoyed the video please hit the thumbs up button. And, if you want videos like this please hit the subscribe and bell button below, you will be notified when a new video is uploaded.